This episode of today's iconic moment in New York sports history is presented by Tri-State Cadillac Dealers. March 28, 1963, an ownership group headed by Sonny Werblin purchased what will become known as the New York Jets. It was the beginning of a new era for the franchise. The Titans of New York were founded in 1959 as an original member of the American Football League. Owner Harry Weismer chose the name because, quote, Titans are bigger and stronger than Giants. The Titans began play in 1960 at New York's Polo Grounds and existed for three seasons. In November of 1962, the owner was unable to make payroll and the AFL assumed cost of running the organization. On March 28, 1963, the team was purchased by Werblin and Gotham Football Club Incorporated for $1 million. Just over two weeks later, the team officially became known as the Jets. He renamed the team the Jets because the U.S. was entering the Space Age or Jet Age and commercial airlines were filling the air. Additionally, they would play near LaGuardia and Idlewood airports. In 1964, the team relocated to Shea Stadium in Queens, and as the Jets, the team acquired Joe Namath and won the American Football Championship in 1968. That same team defeated the heavily favored Baltimore Colts in Super Bowl III by a score of 16-7. That victory remains the only Super Bowl won by the New York Jets. The team joined the NFL after the AFL-NFL merger back in 1970. Since 1968, the Jets have appeared in the playoffs 13 times, but have never won an AFC championship. The Jets have four division titles, the last one coming in 2002.